And by the time she was five years old, her facial hair, which completely covered her face, was more than 13 centimeters or five inches long. It had grown to a whopping 23 centimeters, nine inches by her adolescence. As Alice's fame grew alongside her hair, her parents decided it was time for her to make more money. They placed her in a unique setting, a storefront. The front of a store would be rented out as a performance space with a mission charged to see Alice. She was set up in storefronts across the country with Professor Weller's one-man band, gaining both fame and money at the time. Although Alice was making a good living, she wasn't doing as well as her other extremely hairy people at the time, such as Jojo the Dog-Faced Boy. This was due to the fact that she lacked major backing from the entertainment industry.